Opening in theaters on December 25th is the film Ferrari, and one of its stars is Shailene Woodley. She's known for her roles in the Divergent franchise, the TV series Big Little Lies, among others, Eva. Yeah, so many things she's done over the years, and I got to sit down with her for an exclusive interview about acting, her career, and her role in a film that combines a very personal story with race car action. If you get into one of my cars, you get in the win. Start your engines. Ferrari is roaring into theaters. The movie focuses on the life of Enzo Ferrari, the Italian racer and entrepreneur whose factory created the legendary sports car. The star-studded cast, Adam Driver, Penelope Cruz, and playing the other woman, Shailene Woodley. If I was a woman like I am now, not 12 years ago, I would not have interfered in another woman's marriage. So you play Ferrari's mistress. I do. I like to refer to her as the love of his life. <laughs> it was Italy during the war. Enzo and Lena met and started this romance, and then she got pregnant during the war. And they decided to stay together throughout her pregnancy and raise this child together. And in our world here, between me and you and Piero, what is best for Piero? What drew you to this role? I was really drawn, honestly, by the idea of working with Michael Mann. I think that he's such an incredible filmmaker, and I found working with him to be incredibly inspiring and moving and has definitely made me a much better artist than I was before working with him. You haven't said a word. What is there to say? The newspapers, the radio, they have it all. I feel like a lot of people, they know the name Ferrari, right? What do you think is going to surprise them about this movie? I think it's easy to assume it's going to be about racing, it's going to be about cars, and obviously those are elements that are important and integral to this story. But so much of this film revolves around the humans behind the cars. It's really a story that's grounded in humanity. It's that humanity, the complexity of complicated people, that draws Woodley to a role. In Dumb Money, she plays the wife of Keith Gill, who famously rocked Wall Street by short-squeezing GameStop stock. There's a dozen reporters on our lawn. You have to testify before Congress. The game has changed. I know. I hear you. I don't think you do. A lot of the preparation for Dumb Money was just trying to educate myself as much as possible on the landscape of it all. How do you choose what roles you're going to pick next? That's a great question and it's such a simple answer. I feel like I get butterflies or I don't. It could be because I read a script and the story hits me and for some reason I get this physical feeling that I'm like, I have to do this. Or it could be a director or an actor. And so the meter for me really has always been like an intuitive physical feeling of, of having butterflies. Her career started at a young age. She's been in everything from The Descendants to the Divergent franchise to Big Little Lies, which earned her both Emmy and Golden Globe nominations. Growing up, my parents had three rules. I had to stay the person they knew I was, I had to stay good in school, and I had to have fun. And if I broke any of those rules, I couldn't act anymore. And I'd show up to auditions with like grassy stains on my knees and sticks in my hair, and all the other girls would have their hair brushed. And I remember feeling so cool because I was showing up the way I really was, not showing up the way my mom thought I needed to be for her daughter to be successful. What advice would you give to young girls looking at this career, wanting to do what you do? Advice to, I guess, other young girls would be like, silence is power and taking a minute to take a breath before we react because the whole world tells me I'm not pretty enough, I'm not smart enough, I'm not funny enough. That all comes from a place of fear instead of from a place of love where we get to look at the world and go, I know that I have something to offer that no one else does and how can I do everything in my power to protect that so that I never lose sight of that. And she told us that kind of annoys her when people ask her, so what are you doing next? So we didn't ask. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll but, find out yes. with the rest of you. But you can see Shailene in Ferrari when it opens in theaters on Christmas Day. Okay. It looks really good. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.